starvation has been a part of human nature since the beginning of time. From the pyramids at Giza to the Great Wall of China, progress has always coincided with innovation. On the Parkland Project, Barra deployed both construction and healthcare innovations that would help shape the future of both industries. The method and techniques that we're using to build this project, many of them are cutting edge. Uh, we're really designing Parkland Hospital for a 60, 80 year lifespan. And when you look that far out into the future, we have no idea really how, how healthcare will be uh, delivered uh, 50 years out. A hospital in general are very, very complex projects and especially this one being a two million square foot hospital, there's just so much happening that they collide too much. To improve construction efficiency, Barra chose to implement building information modeling, also known as BIM. This process would generate a detailed virtual model, which would serve as an ever-changing blueprint for the project. As a Barra team, we saw the potential of using it on the parking project. Having Barra on board early, we were able to start working in 3D from the very beginning, the design team was. So the HDR Corrigan team created a BIM model uh, that started out uh, right during master planning. And that model really became the framework that, that the building uh, that you see out there is built around. We can actually fly through the system and look at everything in a 3D representation of what's really going to be out there. We actually had a, our subcontractor go in and model in every piece of rebar, every piece of duct work, just to look for clashes. Where BIM has helped tremendously is we can draw it up, do all the clash detection, and be sure that when we go out there to install our systems, nothing's going to go wrong. Utilizing the advancements of mobile technology in the 21st century, Barra chose to add a digital device to the toolbox, the iPad. This use of tablets on the job site would prove to be indispensable. This is probably the best gadget we have here on site. We use it every day. There's 3,500, 3,600 drawings for this project. Pretty much anything that I need as an assistant superintendent here on site, I can use the tablet for. We can get all our drawings on iPads, go out there, flip through thousands of sheets of drawings, and submittals and also RFIs whenever we need them. I can just stay here. I don't have to go to the office to grab anything. I've got everything on here. I, I would say it probably saved me about two hours a day. From facility information modeling to the construction of a 60-foot cantilever, the list of innovations goes on. But every effort Barra made was determined by a singular goal, to create a healthcare facility that would serve the community for generations to come. It's just been a real great experience to be involved in something this, this big and, and it's changing the, the way everything's going and the way everything's driving into the future. Overall, this project is a signature project that I think many in the healthcare community will look upon as a first class project. A lot of lives will be saved and a lot of healing will take place in this new building. Thank you.